Hi guys, so this is a Mac Duels video, so let me just go to my mic real quick. Um, so sorry about this, if there's any mic noise that's being picked up. So, basically, I'm just going to show you um, the one deck I played against that I lost against um, first. The next one is um, it's the opponent's deck. Um, I lost against this deck, uh, so this deck, uh, basically, the whole point of this deck is to turbo out two of these guys, and then special summon, uh, this guy, and this guy, that's what they did at least, and then summon this guy, he gains attack for, um, the ranks of the XYZ monster currently on the field. And then after that, he special he, he special summons Catapult Turtle, and I mean he summons Catapult Turtle by tributing uh, this guy. He's just gonna get an effect and act as tribute fodder. And then um, once uh, he goes away, um, because when she he actually acts as tribute fodder, and then this guy acts as negates just to get the kill of the same thing, and then. He basically um, acts as the, the damage dealer. So once you do where she left, you summon Capital Turtle, and then you, you act like Capital Turtle's effect and launch it per game. And so, in order to build this deck, you need uh, two SR for now. Well, two SR for these guys. I mean, 30 SR for these guys, so 60. Then these are rares. And these are 690 UR, and then uh, 90 SR, uh, 60 UR, uh, 60 SR, more UR, more SR, more SR, and so then SR, SR, UR. SR, UR, more UR, and then SR. Like this whole deck only has the um two easy to get cards, so this one and this one, which is rare and normal. Everything else is SR <laughs> and UR. This is UR, 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 US rare, that's for two easy cards, and then SR and UR. And so, because uh, I decided to go first, I decided to let them go first because I was playing a deck that I don't remember, I think it was. Um, this deck I was playing, I don't remember what it was, but. But. But basically. Oh. I was playing this version of Infernoids I made. I'll show you that deck list too, just in case you want to see it. Um, so, but in most of the deck lists I've been actually playing the same exact thing. But um, I just let them go first. I probably, if I even not, even if I let them go first, I probably would have not. Passed. That could help anyway, because I'm like, well, yeah. well, you see, what they do is uh, this guy, one of that guy, I can get a fetch, summon him, add a material, like the kind of galaxy. Get 17,000 and then tribute summon I create effect and I lost. And that's how they won that game. And this is the one I won. Um, this is the opponent's deck. They're playing a Time Lord deck. Yeah, this one isn't as uh, cool as the other one because uh, I lost that one. But I won this one because mainly this deck has triple maxi, which has which is which is 30 UR each. So 
third, which is there you are, so that's 90. Plus this card, which is is you are and uh, you are, but you get this one. Most of these cards you get in getting this one, this one, and these ones you get free to win. And so these ones you have to craft, but they just filled up their extra deck for for these these cards right here. So this card, which is SR, and this card, which is an SR, basically you banish three cards. When you banish six cards, you draw one card based on how many you you basically banish. And so um, this one you banish six at random, so six versus twelve. So that's what why you have fifteen cards in your and then a um, power duality, which reveal three cards, draw one of them. Then right back to your deck. You have this one here to prevent people from basically um, paying 500 life points. You pay 500 life points, and for each normal card, card normal summon, and then this basically bounces back damage. And so, Medion basically deals damage by returning all cards back to hand. This card basically um, deals damage, stops damage every time your opponent draws a card. This one destroys all spells. This one makes your life points go back to 4,000. Goes to 4,000 if you, if you um, are less than 4,000. This one um, inflicts 500 damage to, to, your, um, to, to your opponent. And they, you one card your opponent has, it gets shelf back in the deck. This half your opponent's life points. This one inflicts damage to your to your opponent's life points. If uh, if your life points are lower than your opponent, and this one um, it basically inflicts damage equal to the opponent's attack of the monster your opponent controls by battle. And this one is the draw one, and this one just does damage based on on 2,000 attacks. So he's running literally uh, thir 31 monsters and uh, uh, six spells. I mean, 33 monsters for six spells and uh, um, one trap. And um, so I'll just show you the one I was, what what, how I was actually playing. But well, I'm going to show you this duel because what I was playing was just Infernalites. So it's not really present against this deck, but more in um, the top. Number five. Say some of that. Make me that guy. The activate Maxi, which would have been, which was uh, a good uh, thing if they had other spells to actually draw to help them. But um, I got that. Normal summon Dextron. Dextron deck. The only reason I was playing playing like this was because of I was playing against Time Lords and I didn't know what kind of variant they were actually running because I've run this thing before. They summoned that guy. I sent that away to banish from Maxi, hoping that it would stop their attack, but um they just re actually positioned it to that guy. And then after that, I activate that card, got that card back, activated this card, this card, that card, got that, set that card. In phase, I had a, a damn raw lava goal, but. Destroyed it, activated the effect, special summon. I couldn't use that card because uh, it's just like an activation. They dealt two extra thousand. I activated uh, the spell.
go card, which basically simple spells the fish instead of back with the back row. Magic attack for game. So I just got basically four four four. And that's how this game won. It was actually won. So, that's that one. I hope you liked it. Thanks for watching. And, uh,